this retro looking beauty is a Skillman C850. I picked this camera up in Taipei, a small camera shop just in Taipei City, Taiwan. And I picked it up, it said it was in the bargain, the broken camera bargain box. The saleswoman in the shop assured me that these had all been tried. They tried to fix all of these and they were definitely broken. So I just thought, oh, well, it looks cool. I can use it as a decoration or use it for some sort of art project where I just take the camera apart and super glue it to a picture frame or something like that. But when I got it home and I had a look at it, it seemed like the only problem was that there was a battery that had swollen inside the battery compartment. And then there was a cable in the top of here, which was possibly for the film advance. It just disconnected. So just reconnected the wire, uh, pulled out the old battery, ran down to 7-Eleven to grab some new batteries for it, got back, stuck the new batteries in, and what do you know? And see, it didn't wind forwards. Oh, that's because the battery door was open. Ooh. Don't worry about that, it happens all the time. There we go. Hopefully I can stay put for a moment. Anyways, got back, shoved the new batteries in, and boom, it works. I don't know why they said that it was definitely broken when it was really easy to repair. I mean, I'm no camera repairer and never repaired a camera in my life, but I thought I'd give it a go rather than just ripping it apart straight away. It looked easy enough to fix and it was. So give me the idea for this video. What results can I get from a broken camera? And here's the results. After this test, when I'd received the film back, I was really impressed. I managed to get a broken camera back to life again, rather than just throwing it in or ripping it apart. So it's kind of cool to see it have a full. Where is it? Heard it creaking. I've managed to get a camera from supposedly completely dead. A few little fixes, about half an hour to an hour of uh, taking it apart connecting some wires up and then just a set of new batteries for a couple of dollars. Yeah, then I had a fully working camera. So I'm pretty happy with that and hopefully it'll inspire more people that are into film photography, especially with these old cameras, a lot of them are broken or they have small problems and they're pretty easy to fix, there's not much to them, but I say that. I'm no camera repairer and maybe I just got lucky with this one. But hopefully people will start to try and fix these old cameras rather than just throwing them away and then they just get wasted. There's no more, no more photos are gonna be taken with them. Anyway, get out there and try it yourself. You never know, you might get lucky as well.